So let's now take a look at an open tank system and the flow of coolant from the tank through the entire system to the outside cooling tower and how that closed cooling work actually operates. The servers dissipate their heat through direct contact with the electronics into the dielectric fluid, which is electrical, which in which they're all baked. What we now have is we have a coolant loop and a water loop. The coolant exits the tank here and flows into the plate heat exchanger. The cooling water enters the, heat, the plate heat exchanger here as well. What occurs here is the exchange of heat from the heated dielectric electrical to the cooling water. The heated water exits here and then exits the building to the cooling towers that are used as the primary heat rejection in this data center. The cooled dielectric coolant, electric cool, then exits the plate heat exchanger and is circulated through the pumps that you can see down on the bottom there and back into the bottom of this tank. That entire loop has a PUE in this data center of 1.04. That means that this data center is spending four cents in electricity for cooling for every one dollar they are paying to operate their service.